my wife who belongs to a woman's club. Uh, she brought the paper home. She got it from one of the other members. And I sat there and read it, and I liked it. <laughs> I was taking another newspaper, and it came daily. However, it was full of editorials that were very incorrect as I saw it. It seemed like in every article throughout the paper, there was a political slant to it. And when I read your paper, the Epic Times, I realized, I said, now this one's right on the button. It calls it like it is. And I very quickly canceled the other newspaper. I enjoy the geopolitical contents. I mean, I really enjoy seeing what's going on in China, Germany, France, uh, India, and Russia, of course. Um, you don't get too much of that in detail in the other newspapers. I see a lot of creeping socialism going on, and, and uh, your paper sure seems to point that out. It's very enjoyable for me in the morning to sit there and read the uh, Epic Times because it's very factual, it's detailed, and I can go over and over. It's very exacting, it's concise, um, there's not a lot of fluff, and one of the things I really enjoy is when you do the two-page spread and you've got graphs and charts showing who the players are on different issues. Uh, you don't find that in a lot of the other newspapers. And it's, it's a very good pictorial on what is going on in the country and outside of the country. I think the Epic Times is a very moral paper. It's, uh, I, everything I read in there is right on the spot. Um, it doesn't carry smut like you find in a lot of the other newspapers. It's uh, just factual, good reporting. I think their mission is uh, right on target. Uh, when I read that paper, you know, I, I just sit there and say, yes, that's exactly what's going on. And I only wish the rest of the uh, country could read the paper. Well, I've really enjoyed the paper. It's a uh, it, it's something I look forward to Saturdays when I get it, and uh, I kind of savor it throughout the week. Uh, reading articles, sometimes I'll read them twice. Uh, I enjoy it, it's a very satisfying paper. It's a truthful paper. It's, it's one that you can put a lot of faith in, and uh, the stories are quality, they're detailed, which I really like, is the details. For example, a story in China and uh, they'll talk about the, uh, the uh, rising economy or the dropping of the economy. They don't just glaze over it, they'll start giving numbers and facts and figures and, and I'm, a, I'm a guy that likes the facts and figures and overall just very very happy with the paper and I'll continue it.